Hi there, Dan. Yeah, these debates are really important under bright studio lights and under pressure. We might get a real sense of what these contenders might be like as Prime Minister. So a TV debate tonight. Earlier, though, we had a first in a Conservative leadership battle, an online hustings. This took place uh, on Zoom. So they went physically together, but we got a very visual sense of what this quintet looks like. The person top left, by the way, was the person convening the debate on the Conservative home website. Not much argy-bargy. Uh, it's very hard to have a row on Zoom, of course. But the headline was Liz Truss really saying that she would axe the planned corporation tax hike uh, from 19 to 25 per cent next year. Now, she came third in the vote yesterday. Penny Mordaunt was second. A real tussle between them. Uh, we've spoken to the country's leading expert on political science, Sir John Curtis, and he says that for all of these contenders, uh, contenders the debates will be make or break, but especially for Penny Mordaunt. A person who would be supporting to one polling company, YouGov, is currently ahead amongst party members, is also very much for the wider public an unknown quantity. And I think perhaps um, if Penny Mordaunt were to do well in these debates, then she might that might be enough to help her to clinch it. But equally, if she were to do badly, then the momentum behind her campaign might well disappear. He knows his stuff, doesn't he? Always good to hear from Professor Curtis. So the first TV debate tonight, Julian, what happens after that? A really busy weekend, Dan, for this final five. So they're going to get through this uh, debate tonight on Channel 4. I think we'll see pictures of the podiums or podi that they'll be uh, standing behind. On Sunday, a very similar debate in a similar studio on ITV. And then on Monday, a vote. Then Tuesday, a vote as well. And depending on whether any contenders drop out along the way, on Wednesday afternoon at 4 p.m., uh, we should be hearing who the final two are. Uh, then a summer of hustings uh, before the uh, Prime Minister is chosen in September. At the moment, the polls suggest a runoff between Sunak and Morden, but as uh, Professor Curtis was saying, anything really could happen in the next few days.